Threepwood. Lost at sea for days now. I have no crew or navigational instruments. No provisions except a half-eaten corn dog, and unless I find water soon, I'm surely done for. Only the hope of finding my love, Elaine, keeps me going. And my quest for the fabulous treasure called Big Whoop has left me in this sorry state. I thought it would bring me fame and glory. Instead, it delivered me into the clutches of my enemy, the zombie pirate LeChuck. I had thwarted his evil plot to marry Elaine, and he was after revenge. How many times do I have to tell you, LeChuck, I just don't feel that way about you? Guy brush, Threepwood. By my gangrenous gut, I don't know how you escaped my carnival of the damned. But you won't escape the taste of my blade! <coughs> ah! <laughs> Throw him in the hold. I'll finish him after the battle. Get out of here and help Elaine. If I could only get through this one door, then I could easily overpower the armed guards above, slip over the side, and make for the shore. Quit your mumbling, captive! Blast ye scurvy dogs! Stand back! I'm Guybrush Threepwood. Who are you? I'm the evil pirate Blood Nose, the wickedest fiend ever to sail under the banner of King Death. I'd as soon chew your nose off as look at you. Are you wearing a fake beard? Blood Nose the pirate would not have a fake beard. Yes, it is. It's been glued to your ear hair. Actually, it's a highly sophisticated beard weave, made from the chest and back hair of real pirates. I'm hoping it'll take root if I don't wash it for a while. Is that hook for real? Of course it's real! A vicious shark tore off me hand! Oh, what a struggle it was! I remember... It is so a fake. It is not! Well, okay, it is. See, I haven't lost my hand yet. This is sort of a training hook. I'm wearing this just to get used to the feel of it. Captain LeChuck says he'll cut my hand off when he gets some free time. I do have a hangnail. You'll probably get infected. Hey, wait a minute. You're not a pirate. Wally! Don't you recognize me? It's Guybrush Threepwood. Oh, gee. Hello, Mr. Wood. The last time I saw you, we were prisoners in LeChuck's dungeon. Why would you sign on with a ship of the living dead? Well, Mr. Brush, at first I had some misgivings about it. But thanks to LeChuck's seminars, motivational lectures, and audiobooks on Parrot, I've become a vicious Corsair. You can too. Ask me how. I'm not in the mood for sales hype. Here, at least take this literature. You may change your mind. You're a failure as a pirate. Shut your trap, you yellow-bellied blowfish. One more peep out of you, and I'll do you in. Yeah, you and what navy? Yes, scabrous swab. One more word, and I'll let you have it. You haven't got the guts. OK, that's it. I'm going to blast you. I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm 
I can't do it. I just can't. <laughs> You're right, Mr. Wood. I'm just not a pirate. I'm not ferocious or bloodthirsty or hateful or anything. I'm not even... I'm not even unpleasant. Oh! Getting pretty good at this. Ooh, gross. All the bones and stuff are floating towards the ship. I can't quite squeeze past this cannon. <laughs> well, they've messed with the wrong skull this time. <laughs> Lose something? I am Murray. The invincible demonic skull! Quake in fear, mortal! For your insolence, I shall now devour you! Uh huh. Could you. Uh, 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 could you pick me up so I can light you? No! I just thought I asked. It's been uh, swell talking to you. Run then! Run! Run away from the fearsome skull! Until you die, I shall revisit you in your most horrible nightmares! <laughs> Whatever. If I could just get my hands on that gunner! If I could just get my hands on him. Hey, that's my arm! Give that back! Ma ah, well, I guess I'll just have to... Oh, <laughs> 